The U.S. charges China with cyber espionage, accusing Chinese military officials of hacking into American companies for trade secrets. China calls the allegations made up, says that the charges will damage U.S.-China relations. Ed Laskos is here to tell us about that, Ed. Master spies leaving their fingerprints all over cyberspace. This, the very first time the feds are charging five foreign agents with cyber spying. Chinese hackers we're talking about here who stole information like product design and confidential strategies all to give their Chinese companies a leg up on American competition. Listen here. Absolutely. I am saying that this cyber hacking leads directly to the loss of jobs here in the United States. And that has landed five Chinese military officers on the most wanted list of the FBI, all charged with economic espionage, all for hacking into big name American companies and stealing their secrets. Listen to the Attorney General. What I think distinguishes this case is that we have um, a state-sponsored entity, state-sponsored individuals using intelligence tools to uh, gain commercial advantage. A commercial advantage said to be in the billions of dollars. The Chinese military agents accused of hacking into some big-name American nuclear and industrial companies, names you know, like Alcoa, Westinghouse, and U.S. Steel. A top expert in cyberspace hacking warns this espionage will not stop until U.S. corporations lock up their own computers. Listen here. Unfortunately, the, it, the corporations back home are not going to change unless someone makes them change. Because if they're losing a certain amount of IP but you can't prove it, and their insurance policy for cybercrime costs them a million a year, mm -hmm. but fixing their systems costs them 20 million a year, mm -hmm. they'll spend that on marketing every single time. So he says it's more sexy for the companies to spend their money on marketing instead of their own security. And aside from our attorney general saying enough, enough already, these Chinese military agents now turned hackers. Experts say it is very, very slim. You will ever see them face a judge in a U.S. courtroom. So, Christine, in other words, don't hold your breath. Is it merely making a statement? I think so. A lot of experts are saying it is a political statement because we know this has been happening for a long time. But again, how much weight does it carry remains to be seen. All right, Ed, thanks.